All right, step one. Step one to what to do if you buy a pair of pants and they're too small and they don't have a bigger size and you just love the um, design. Number one, you can um, you can cut the you turn them inside out, which I have done. You can see they're cut straight in the hip. They are turned inside out. You can see that. You have to have your pens, okay? These, stick, these are stick pens, okay? You want to have your stick pens because when I cut this open, I'm gonna have to put some insert. I uh, um you. Find your own material. You cut it from any scrap of um, something you don't use anymore. These jeans are gray. Okay, so I'm going to match them up on the side with this uh, gold and black and red. Light red. And I'm going to put them in here. I'm going to cut this open. And put them in. I have my safety pins. I have my measuring tape. The measuring tape is good so that you can make sure that the strips are the same size for both sides when you do both sides you want both sides to be exactly the same length and the same width and when you sew them of course this is going to go this way when I sew it not that way so that when I sew it open it up and sew it on this part will be showing on the outside of the pants leg which like I said again it's gray dark gray so that will match really perfectly uh, I got this little sewing kit which is really great I have this pin cushion when you take the pins out of you know when you're done sewing you want to make sure that you put your your pins in your pin cushion that way you can find them they don't get lost you don't get stuck later all right so, um, this is part one. This is part one of what I'm going to do right now. This is to open, if you stitch it wrong, you can use this to open the stitching up and start over, basically. You just keep that on there so that, um... I don't want any to get stuck by anything, so I'll just put that top back on. And I have um, some safety pins just in case you know I need to do something else with this before I'm done. So this is step one again. Uh, what to do? You don't have to always go to a tailor. Sometimes you have money for a tailor. Sometimes you work too hard and you don't have time to stop by the tailor and pick things up. Sometimes you don't have money for a tailor. Some, you know, I know about both sides of the fence. One side has money and one side it doesn't. And I know both sides. So this is number one. is the measuring tape. My scissors to open this up and measure on both sides how much. I'm going to use the pens to verify where to stop, where to stop the cutting on both sides. All right, and I'll be back for step two. Peace, love, and light. This is the songbird, reborn. And uh, this is part two of how to make my pants fit if they're too small. And as you can see, I opened up both sides, turned them inside out first, and I use the pens to pen them, pen it down. I used a piece of material from an old skirt that I have that I never really wore, but I bought it and it didn't fit right, so I just kept it. This is stretchable material. This material stretches. Um, I'm gonna have to get a, a phone holder because I can't hold the phone and do what I have to do. Basically, um, so I opened it up, and as you can see, and I used a tape measure to measure the length and the width of the material. But I finished now. I did both sides, made sure they were both the same length and width. Now I'm going to turn them inside out. I mean, back the right way. And I have to put the phone down because I don't have a phone holder. Hold on. Now past the hip and up. I started here. I used 
this part of the pants, which is above the pocket here, to um, to start, you know. So this is the, the outside now. I used the material that I wanted. See, it stretches, it stretches. And that's on both sides. As you can see, it stretches. And uh, so all I have to do now is to to um, clean this up right here a little bit, make it more presentable with my scissors, and uh, or I could just leave it that way. Just to no, I think I'll clean that up right there. I see how it's a little jagged there. I know my camera's dark a little bit. And the pants are dark, so it's kind of hard to see. Um, so. But now I have all this extra space for my hips to fit these pants. <laughs> and I, I sewed them backwards using a stitch. Love and light. 